Hi there, thanks for tuning in. Here's a super quick video all about how to set up MIDI CC assignments in Impact Soundworks contact products. If you have hardware MIDI controllers with sliders and dials, or even an expression pedal, you can use these to control the various parameters of Impact Soundworks instruments. Your hardware controls send out what's called MIDI CC, or MIDI control change data. Let's have a quick look at how to implement this CC data, taking the Impact Soundworks Bansuri as an example. And this has many onboard controls such as dynamic, vibrato and flutter. By default, the dynamic parameter is mapped to MIDI CC1. That's most likely the mod wheel of your keyboard. If you right click your mouse on the dynamic slider, you can see that information. It's possible to remove this CC assignment by right-clicking and selecting Remove MIDI Automation CC1, CC1 being the mod wheel. You can also learn MIDI CC in the same way, with a right-click on a dial or slider and then select Learn MIDI CC Automation. Then you just move the hardware controller that you want to assign. In this case, we'll use the mod wheel again. There's no limit to the number of multiple CC assignments. I could just as easily assign the mod wheel CC1 to both dynamics and vibrato, so that when the bansuri is played more loudly, more vibrato is introduced. What about assigning the flutter slider to CC11, which is my expression pedal? Again, very easy to do. For more information about assigning hardware controllers to Impact Soundworks contact instruments, please check out the individual product manuals. And thanks so much for watching.